what's up y'all so i'm back with another video and today we're going to be making two ribeye steaks and we're going to be broiling them so i got my ribeye steaks here i've washed them and now i'm going to go ahead and i'm going to dry them off with a paper towel um so that my seasoning can stick really really well to my steaks you can use anything you can use a cloth you can use paper towel um or whatever you have in the kitchen that's clean obviously um, to dry your steaks off so first i'm gonna go in with a couple of seasons i'm gonna start off with my accent i love my accent brings out your flavors and your food um then we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna do um some garlic powder which is usually my favorite i love garlic and everything i feel like minced garlic and all that i didn't put minced garlic today on my steaks but definitely my garlic powder um, and then I'm going to go ahead and use some onion powder. I use onion powder. I use some black pepper, a little seasoned salt, and then I use a steak and chopped seasoning by Weber's Grill. So you just see me here just continuing on with my seasonings, just getting that steak kind of coated. And I like my steak flavor, not salty. There's a difference. Not salty, but flavored. So I definitely like my steak to be flavored. So yeah, I'm going to cover that steak just a little bit with those seasonings. And then we're going to get it into the oven after a while. So that's the steak and chop seasoning. I love that seasoning. Like it's so delicious. I use it on burgers too. Even though it just says steak and chop, I use it on burgers. So I'm going to go ahead and flip it. Um, and when I flip it, I'm going to go ahead and do the same thing. I'm going to season that side, but I'm going to speed it up because I know you don't want to see me season again. So. Now that it's all seasoned, I'm going to go ahead and all that extra seasoning, I'm going to dab that outer area of marble and fat that's along the outside. I'm going to dab all that with the excess seasoning that's left on the cutting board because we don't want that to go to waste. And we just want to make sure that our steak is completely covered all on both sides and on that outer area. And it's just going to be so delicious. Look at Layla. Layla always wants to help me cook. So she's always like lurking around. All right, so here comes the fun part, y'all. The... Now, here... now here comes the debate. Here's the debate. No, nah, don't try to take over. She thinks that you can't boil from the bottom. Well, so back in the day, I do know that you were supposed to be able to broil from the bottom. However, I said that I tried it on this stove and it didn't work, but I can broil on the inside, which my sister told me that the new stove lets you broil from the inside. So what you wanna do right now? We should have took one steak and put one steak down there and one steak on the inside to see what's gonna cook. Wanna do that? Yep, that's what we got to do. Okay, let's do it. Okay, so we gonna get Let's get a smaller pan. Both the same. Yeah. Yeah. Should we get out of there? That's it. butter right here. Mama. Let's do some butter on there. Hold on, Lila. Huh? Hold on. We'll put some butter on here. Can we help you? Hold on. My steak all lonely in this big old pan. Let me move to the center. Butter, Mom. All right, go Come on, Bubba. Okay, so that should be good. All right, now here's the debate. So mine is gonna go inside, and yours is gonna go down under. Okay, ready? So let's put yours down. We're gonna get that suck up out of there. <laughs> Watch out. And then we're gonna put mine. Oh gosh. Mine. Inside. Ooh, you feel it? You feel it? Oh, 
Mm-hmm. It's hot. Okay. So that's that. Huh? First. So I'm gonna flip mine first. Cause we just gonna do seven minutes on each side. Ooh, that's Watch out guys. Watch out. Ooh. What is that? I'm gonna flip it. Okay, that was mine. Now <laughs> you excited. I feel like you way too excited. That's sure. It's <laughs> cooking, ain't it? It is cooking. Uh oh, I don't want to fall on the floor. I'm sorry, so, don't, don't, don't sabotage me. <laughs> Y'all see she's trying All to sabotage me. Right. It's cooking. Okay. I'll give it to you. But it's cooking in both areas, right? Don't try to make it out of nothing. You just had a what whole I'm fight. What is it You is. just had a whole fight with me about. Oh, they don't work at the bottom. The new stove don't work That's at the what, bottom. It wasn't. The day I used it, it's it was not. It's a whole thing at the bottom. She told me it was a pot holder, y'all. <laughs> she told me it was a pot holder. <laughs> I did yes. say it was a pot holder. <laughs> let me put it bad, out. Being bad. I did say it was a pot holder. She said it was a pot holder. I was, I, but my mama did have a stove that was a pot holder. Like it wasn't nothing down there. It was a pot holder. It wasn't a rack or anything. Like seriously. <laughs> That's funny. It was, it's true though. The face of a cheater. Go on, tell him what you did. What did I do? Go on, tell him what you did. What did I do? Go on, tell him what you did. All right, I must leave mine in there as well. And it's good. You say what? We ain't hear you. Oh, is you eating mine? No, it's mine. Which one mine? Huh? Look how you want mine. Oh, okay. That's so good. Come on. Come on. And it cooked at the bottom. We out. <laughs>